annual Columbus Day Carnival and Parade continued today in Eastchester despite a violent incident that sent crowds running for safety Saturday night. News 12's Carol Wilkinson brings us the latest. If you want to see Italian pride in full effect, check out the annual Columbus Day Carnival in Eastchester. Restaurant owner John DeGrazio has seen the event grow and evolve over the last several years, drawing crowds with offerings of good food, fun and games for the entire family. Columbus Day heritage from back in the day brings people together, food, good fun, good spirits. And that's why you're here. That's why I'm here. But sadly, on Saturday evening, the friendly festival was marred by violence when a fight broke out between two teenage boys. The boy in the black can be seen using the BB gun in his right hand to hit the boy in the white. Viral social media posts claimed that shots had been fired and that someone was even hit by bullets. Police say those posts were untrue. Fast forward to the carnival on Sunday. Christopher Columbus is putting in an appearance. The camaraderie is back. And attendees like Debbie Nunez are proudly wearing their Italian pride close to their hearts. Celebrating the Italian pride. I'm enjoying everybody in this beautiful day. And our Zeppelis and all our Italian food. It's the kind of celebration that keeps John Brower coming back again and again. Celebrating Italian heritage, I do it. I've been doing it for years hanging out with all the, my Italian friends and everything, and just the Italian spirit, yes. The Columbus Day Festival continues through Monday at 6 p.m. at the Lake Isle Country Club. In Eastchester, Carol Wilkinson, News 12.